There have been days of eager anticipation prior to this gargantuan clash, but now we need talk about it no more and instead focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle no matter who you support. Two high-level sides ready to go at it. You're watching EA TV. Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Doncaster Rovers, and they face Bournemouth. Well, thanks, Derek. These fans will be fairly pleased with their team's start to this campaign. They've competed well, they've shown tactical discipline, and they've been energetic. It will be another tough game today. Real chance! Oh, that is a wonderful piece of challenging. Can they convert? An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. And goal news to bring you in the Brighton game. And Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for Brighton. The shot was ferocious and it went in off the woodwork. They're the first on the score sheet here with only eight minutes played. This is what we love to see. Back to you, Derek. Many thanks, Alex. Pulls it back. Clean challenge. Man. Nicolas Seiwald. Amin Adli. Kamada. And possession changing hands. And just hearing, ball in the net at Stamford Bridge. Over to Alex Scott. It's a goal for Chelsea. They've scored the opener here with 18 minutes played. Just the start they would have wanted. Back to you, Derek. Thank you, Alex. Moving into the advanced position. Who can he pick out? Nicely timed tackle. Hadji. Marine. Mihaila. Oh, a really crisp effort, but just wide. Nicolas Seiwald. Being pressed and pressed high. Just had no time on the ball on account of the pressure. Now, what can they produce on the flank? And lining it up. And ready to strike. Still alive. And held by the keeper at the second time of asking. Well, he's just pulled off a great first save there. Now they can all calm down. Is this the moment? And a goal to square the game. Edge of the seat stuff. 
Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Mihaila. And Bournemouth have it back now. Could be dangerous. Oh my goodness, you've really got to praise the defending. That was top notch. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Now the cut back. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. So getting close to the half-time interval and it's going with home advantage, albeit not by a lot. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen so far? Yeah, it's certainly been an open game, but on the balance of play, I think they do deserve their lead. They just have that little bit more creativity, particularly in the wide areas. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. We're using the space really well, but now can they push on? Oh, crucial tackle, brilliant! And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. No oh, chance, perhaps. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Olympiou Morutsan. And ball back with Bournemouth here. Lewis Cook. Cook. The cross is on. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Zeibald. Cook. Chance to equalise. Can they cover up? And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. There's been so much speculation in terms of whether the transfer would go ahead, but it will go ahead, Stuart. Well, with a price tag of £80 million, the expectations will be huge. He's a player with great skill, but the fans will be demanding an immediate impact from him. Let's hope he gives it to them. Yanis Hadji. Daichi Kamada. On to Stokes. And a useful cross. Oh, that's a fine save. An example of a goalkeeper in top form here. And he takes it away. Jaden Anthony. And teammates to play it to. Can he take the chance? And he squandered the chance to equalise. Well, I have to say, that's a wasted opportunity. They should be level here. Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Doncaster Rovers facing Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. Hadji. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Oh, 
Collecting to cross into the centre. The save was a good one. And the substitution will occur now. Well, the short corner routine. Nicolas Zeiwald. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Olympiou Morutsan. Manea has it. Valentin Mihaila on the offensive. And space to cross it. Teamwork and passing in evidence. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Bournemouth facing Crystal Palace. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. It's looking promising. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. So a personnel change then. Ten minutes to go. Well, still time for them to level it. In with a chance. And the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. Well, they fancy a short one. Genuine chance. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Five minutes left. Eric Corbello. Not smooth in possession. He continues his run. Able to skip past his man. Really good build up, but no end product. Teammates available. So a goal kick is what's coming up here. Pedrosa, Nicolas Zeiwald, and there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, it's been a very good start for them, and today they showed what a well-organised side they are. Can they just keep it going now? That's the big question. They certainly look confident. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.